don't need to do So, Reynard. Yes, my dear? Reynard, I need a huge favor. Oh? Uh, I hope you're feeling rested because it involves getting back to Wunderhorn. Oh. But we found out where Queen Yannicka went. She's in Glass Mountain, so... So you are in need of the Red Dragon to escort you once more, am I right? Please, Reynard. You're the only one fast enough to get there before the wedding. Ah, uh, indeed, indeed. I could do the trip in time. If it were anyone else, I would find the proposition most humorous. <laughs> but... because it's me, then? Then how could I possibly refuse? Yay! Thank you. You're my hero, Reynard. <laughs> well, if you are indeed correct, we may both be heroes. And too many at that. With said pressing circumstances, I shall bid you adieu, my dear, and be on my way. Wait, there she is. Reynard, you did it. Thank you so much for coming, both of you. All right, yes, let's not waste any time. I can't thank you enough, Red Dragon. If I'm right about this, you might very well have just helped save the Queen. Well, let's hope so anyway. It's all broken and crooked. Looks like the mountain has grown right over it. Hold on, hold on. Hello again. Ah, you! Go away, go away, go away, go away! Not possible, Rink Rink. I don't have time for this. Mm -hmm. You said you would go away! I know I did, I'm sorry. I just didn't know she was in there. I knew it! I knew you were taking her away! But she's not safe, Rink Rink. You have to listen to me. I'm here to help her. And if I don't, then someone much worse will come. Someone who will want to hurt Queen Yannicka. Person wants to come here and hurt her? I'm afraid so. Please. Promise to be gentle with her? Yes, of course. I'm not here to hurt anyone. <laughs> Fine! Hurry up, hurry up! Well, she. she's. beautiful. Yeah. And she's been like this all this time? In the glass? She was like this always! Glass around her, glass all over the floor, but glass was breaking. Then... stopped! When... when... Wait, wait! Glass stopped breaking after Rick Rake gave you Rose! Ah, now you're in Rick Rake's house! Ah! Shh, Rink Rank, it's okay. I was tricked, okay? I'm here to help her. <laughs> Fine! You... you better not... not... better not... hurt her. I'm not sure I've ever seen such beautiful flowers. My gosh, who would have thought something like these would be growing up here? Rink Rink mentioned these appearing when Yannicka was trapped. If that's the case, they surely have something to do with the spell. But what is it? Well, they certainly could have something to do with this spell on Yannicka, but what would I do with them? It's the message I found on the back of the portrait. Is it... It's the message I found on the back of the portrait. Is it part of a spell? Ah, yes. These definitely seem to go together. Little shards, little shards. Ah, yes. I hope this is what the message is for. Let's see. Ahem. Little shards, little shards. In you I confide. You also hear the other side. 
Huh? Aha! Oh, gosh! Oh, my gosh! That is adorable! What do I do now? Are there any notes on little glass people? This will be tricky, but not sure I have much choice. Now, if I remember the blackboard puzzle, then... Mm, oh, phew! That... that was my best effort yet! Aha! I really think I'm starting to understand this now. Hmm... I'll be right back, Rink Rink. Hopefully with a way to help her. Huh? Yes, whatever. Whatever. But I'll be so sit tight. Try. Anna, you're back. Ben, we were right. I made it to the mountain, and she was there all right. She was? Is she okay? Yeah, she seems to be fine, but Winfrieda has sealed her in glass. I can't break it. Now it's just a matter of finding out what we can about the spell. Nothing in this one. Hello there. You're a long way from Glass Mountain, aren't you? All right, come along now. Let's take you to your friends, huh? If you just sit still for a second. Ah, slippery little thing. Cute, but wait, Anna, focus. I need to get him back to Glass Mountain. All right, ready to go again? Remember? You were trapped. Oh, yes. Yes, of course. Glass Mountain. You... who... You saved me. But how? Me? I'm Anna, your highness. I found Winfrieda's secret room, and, well, before that I was... Winfrieda? Winnie? The wedding? Oh, no. The wedding. You don't mean Winnie... ...is marrying the king today. That's why I came here, you see. Then it really is too late. She's done it after all these years. She has proven Mother wrong, just like she said she would. She has finally succeeded in fighting the Wanderer's telling of word. Huh? Wait. No, it's not too late. I've saved you. So we can go and stop the wedding. Come on, let's go do this. Quick, quick. Uh, your highness? Anna, for saving me, you have my greatest thanks. You have done so well. For that, the least I can do is help you understand why. Why now, there is not we can do. Stay with Rink Rank, yes! What, what do you mean? No, hold on, Yannicka. You can stop her. You can stop the wedding. Don't you see? If the queen comes back, Winfrieda can't marry the king. Indeed, this would be the outcome. But Anna, this wedding means everything to her. It is the culmination of her efforts. And to disrupt that, with all those people there, it would be disastrous. But, but, we can't just let her become queen. So, we have to... 
find a way to end this peacefully? Somehow. I tried. Many years ago, I tried. But she rejected me. For her, peace is not an option. She has a hate that can't be reasoned with. She has always fought her way through life. This would be no exception. Who is Winfried of fighting? Word? Oh no, not who, but what. How do I say? It is a kind of fate, I suppose. But it's more complicated than that. Word is the pattern that shapes our destinies. Influenced in many ways by everything we do, everything our ancestors did. Causality and consequence. It is what will happen, is happening, and what has already happened. Oh. Uh, okay. But what about this does Winfrieda not like? Winnie, we were but children when she... She did something unforgivable. It forever shaped what word would mean for Winfrieda. What would become her destiny. Suffice it to say, it was not to Winfrieda's liking. And she swore to fight against it. What did Winfrieda do? Perhaps it's best not to bring up the past. All that needs to be understood is her greed for power. It has always been her motivation, even back then. Wait, wait, wait. Our parents? You and Winfrieda are sisters? Indeed. Raised by our parents at the Volk School of Witchcraft. Then your family. You have to be able to reason with her. That is exactly why I cannot. She envies me. Perhaps even hates me. After her path and word was decreed, she ran away from home. We are strangers to one another. Are those unfortunate childhood memories? No. No, that's not right. However near or far we may be, in our hearts we carry our family. I'm sorry? There's something more to this. The portrait I took from her. Look. This... Where did you get this? This is... was my family. This... this was mother's. I remember now. It went missing, right? Right after Winfredo ran away from home. Janneke, she still had it with her. If she kept it all these years, then your family means something to her still. Hmm... I suspect she has different reasons for that, Anna. She's determined to prove word wrong in every way. And part of that is retaining how she used to look before word changed her. But she kept the whole portrait, in a safe even, and the spell. She wrote the spell on it. It said, you also hear the other part. She means her part, right? Anna, listen to me. You cannot hope to understand her. Any sense of reasoning is buried far beneath a blind, hate-filled need for revenge. Revenge for something she feels was undeserved. But the sad truth is, it was all her own doing. She just can't accept it. What are you doing here? Why did you leave the castle? I... am not proud of it. I acted in haste. But now I must stand by my actions. During the night, Winfrieda had snuck into the castle unawares and confronted me. She was in a rage. She talked to me of how her time had come, and she threatened me with... with Bernhardt's life. Oh no, Ben. I can't say why, but a spell taught in my childhood suddenly came to mind. An animal familiar spirit spell to guide and protect. It made sense, but to cast such a spell is to put your own mind in a constant state of rest. So... so you needed to put yourself in a place where you could do that? Precisely. I cast a spell on myself to transport to the furthest reach from Winfrieda, and from here I called upon the animal familiar spirit to protect Bernhardt. It took him body and mind and has protected him to this day. That's why you don't want to leave, isn't it? If you do, the spell won't work. Then, he won't be safe from Winfrieda. With each passing moment I am not resting, the connection to the animal familiar spirit wanes. All those people left behind, though. Not everyone can be protected from her. I... I know. But I can do nothing for them. It is not within my power. What is, is protecting Bernhardt. So that is what I must continue to do. Anna, I... 
I'm afraid I have spent too much time in unrest. You must excuse me. No. No, wait. The Wizard of Vundahorn. He told me something. He said that you are the only one strong enough to reverse her magic. Me? But I do not practice in magic anymore. My path in word was to become queen. I could not rule people in fear of me. Winnie, she has only grown in power over the years. She is stronger than I ever was. But the wizard also... If you don't stop her, then... What then? I... I am sorry, Anna. Deeply sorry. I am without answer to Winfrieda's threat, and so I have to think of Bernhard. I have to protect him. Please, leave me be so I may rest now. <sighs> Yannicka might not want to leave, but there is one thing I think I can take with me. <laughs> 